Mombi said she ain't minding us. Have fun, boo. Dre. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> yeah. she's. I need to stop calling Dre Dre because Mombi keeps is starting to call him Dre. Dre says I should call him what? <laughs> so Mombi can listen and call him Dada. Yeah. 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 What is our dilemma right now? Um, Please show me. I'm trying to figure out this water situation because um, this is new to us. Some people may be familiar with this, but we don't know what's going on. We have this water right here in the, in the blue container, and we don't know if it's for bathing or if we use it for the toilet. I mean, we know that much. We yeah, know this. Yes. One of the waters exactly. is for the toilet. Yes. But then we're like, wow, those two little buckets there. Well, this one is to use to, like, to rinse yourself off. The small one. You know, you rinse yourself off with the small. But I'm not really worried about... To rinse things. yourself off when you're showering? Or because sometimes those water tanks down there, they run out of water. So when they run out of water, you use this one here, I'm assuming, to rinse yourself off. The, you use the little green thing? The little green one kind of, you know, do a quick wash up. That's what that's for. Okay, then what is this for? I don't know where this water is coming from. I don't know if whenever it fills up, do you pour it in here or do you use this one for a toilet? That's not a problem right now. It's a good thing Dre noticed it because he was like, this thing's about to overflow. I mean, still, it spilled a little bit. But then when he tried to pour it on the blue thing, he said, it don't look like the same. But then he was like, it looks the same. We feel special. Extremely special. And the guy probably just gonna come in here and pick this up and pour it in there. And be like, <laughs> You okay? <laughs> but here we're fine. Okay, whenever we arrived yesterday, I was like, Is there anything else we need to know? And he looked at me like, Anything else? I guess he was assuming we automatically know. Mm -hmm. We don't know. <laughs> <laughs> But I don't, he told us to put it in the WC. And I'm thinking. Dre said. Water container. Water container. Which is this it big It will be blue. the funniest thing if that's not what he meant. Okay. It's explore day. I love explore days. But we're going to go see the monument. And the monument by the beach. And what else are we going to see? Whatever else we can see today. So like a lot of museums and stuff. Just gonna go from there. Yeah. So we looking forward to it. I can't believe. I can't believe we're on a travel day. I mean the next four day. <laughs> All right. Come along. Okay. We ended up getting. Finally made it. I mean, <laughs> I don't even know what to say because uh, the camera does no justice with the stairs. That's all you gotta say. Like the camera does no justice. I mean, steep, it is well. it is steep. Like that's why it's tall. It is a lot of stairs. It's like a mountain you climb it. I'm so glad we brought that big old bottle of water because we're gonna need it. <laughs> we're gonna need it. But yeah, so far so good. Um, it was only a 10 minute ride where, right where we was at. All right, guys, we're starting our walk up. How you feel so far? Not bad. It's not bad. But so we're at the beginning of the walk. Yes, we're only two. What would you call it? Me. I don't know. But we this still have. Course, there's 11 sections yeah, of stairs. Yeah. 
We're not even halfway there yet. <laughs> so far, I mean, they have like these little sections off the side. If you need to stop and take a break, you can. So yeah, so let me show you guys that. So yeah, as you guys are walking up, you can just stop and take a break. Can they have these little pictures? And actually enjoy your view, see the coast. The coast is just right up over there. So yeah, not bad at all. You made it to the top. Yeah. Wasn't bad at all to be honest. It's just, you know, cause when you're walking up, you stop. Think about it. You stop at um, the little sections and, and uh, take your few pictures and admire. and admire the view. And before you know it, you at the top. So it's not bad at all. The statue is supposed to represent like the liberation from the, the country that was colonizing them. So it's pretty much like the independence. So it symbolizes independence. And it's made out of bronze. They yes. said the man is a hundred ton, the wife is 70 ton, and the baby's 20 ton. Right. Heavy, heavy. It's heavy, heavy too, right. because we were in Mexico for a while and we we're speaking Spanish. We knew so much from there and we just, our minds cannot figure out what language, what country we're in or what land. No, we know which country we're in. We can't figure out what language to use because man, this taxi man was trying to take us back to our spot and we were trying to tell him here and we were like, Aki, Aki! <laughs> I'm like, he's like, he's like right here. I'm like, see, si, see. Si. And she's like, we, we. Why are you speaking Spanish? I'm like, you speak Spanish too. <laughs> so we'd be like, yes, see, si, we. <laughs> I don't know. That's us. We say it to go three times. They speak a few different languages here. Uh, and then they speak French. There's another language that they speak. That one, and then uh, a little bit of English. Some people you bump into speak will speak English. Yeah. But for the most part, I mean, 
What, what's the primary language you see they French? I want to say French. It's French and then Wallof. Yeah. Oh, Wallof then French. Yeah. However the order is. But yeah. it's the funniest thing because we just be, yes, see, we, a key, a key. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm at the bar. Au revoir. Ciao. Uh, <laughs> just everywhere. It's the funniest thing. I know the driver's take what's wrong with these people? <laughs> but we back. Oh my god, they came and cleaned the room. It looks so nice. We if we knew if we knew they were gonna come and clean today specifically, we would have legitimately cleaned up ourselves, like organized our stuff. But it smells good and clean. This is what we came to. She put the suitcases on top of each other, made the bed. It's kind of organized a little bit for us because before it was all over the place. But it's a nice spot. Look confused again. She just took down the whole shower head and put it in here. At first, we was like, we need to slow down on like using the water because we was like, we didn't want to run, run out of water. So we just been kind of trying to, you know, be. Mindful. Yes, mindful of how we use Our the water. water. Use it, yeah. And then we get back today and she drops the okay. whole bucket. It's full. Yeah. So it makes me wonder, so are we supposed to use that bucket to shower? Maybe that's I mean, what it is. No. Because, I don't know. Oh I mean, yeah, because you have to. You know, we put the milk for a moment before she throws it in the toilet. Because you have to flush the toilet. So how else do you flush the toilet? You see what I'm saying? But why she put the whole thing? I guess she was just letting just, it fill up. Yeah, fill it up. It's already filled up. And then when the shower, you just put it back up there? Yeah. Hmm. Mm -hmm. That's the way to go about it. We're learning. Mm -hmm.